<laughs> no, actually, hey, you got to be happy about all this moisture we're receiving. Yes. Uh, just got a phone call from a viewer in Chile. Said it's blizzard-like conditions over the mountain in the Estancia Valley, and so you want to watch out there. Very low visibility. Let's go ahead and take a look at the radar and show you what's going on. You can see a lot of moisture pushing in the Rio Grande Valley. The further south you go, turns into more or less rain. But we're seeing a lot of mix out there, and it's all uh, mainly snow, though, once you get up around the foothills and also back off towards the heights. Obviously, the Sandias and Manzano's dealing with some pretty good snow as well. There's your watches and warnings. We do have uh, winter storm watches, or rather winter weather advisories across the Rio Grande Valley, areas off towards the north, and also a winter storm warning down up here, rather, into the uh, Four Corners area. That's in effect through early tomorrow morning as well. So keep that in mind. Already we've seen a little bit of snow again around uh, Albuquerque, north of Albuquerque, back off towards the heights, and the uh, Sandias and Manzano's getting a little bit of snow there, as you can see there in the pink. Let's zoom in a little bit closer, show you what's going on right now. Again, it's mainly turning over to rain around Socorro. Of course, Albuquerque getting that mix, and we're seeing a lot of that turning over to snow. Meanwhile, you get out towards Grants, and it's all snow, so roads are going to be a little bit treacherous, especially heading through the canyon this afternoon and this evening. You may want to get a head start on that commute home this evening, as uh, it's hard to drive in these conditions, obviously. So, uh, take a look at what we're going to expect tonight. 34 degrees, good chance for some snow showers, and tapering off by tomorrow morning as we start out in the 20s. And actually, tomorrow doesn't look like it's going to be too bad. A little treacherous driving for the Durango area. This is downtown. You can see the snow piling up on the roads, making those roads awfully white. And you want to be careful. But check out Wolf Creek Pass, and it is pretty much... Uh, <laughs> ice pack up here and snowy. You want to watch out there up in the southern areas of Colorado as well. So with that, we've got temperatures in the 20s and 30s. You head down towards Socorro. Here is why we're seeing rain. We're 47 degrees. Albuquerque 39, but you can bet those numbers are going to be dropping pretty quickly here. So here's what's going to happen from now and into the overnight hours. We'll continue with the chance for snow. Notice the Estancia Valley getting into the mix overnight to, or at least this evening and back up towards the Four Corners. And then as we head into tomorrow morning, things kind of start to taper off, and just in time for New Year's Eve festivities, we clear out the skies, maybe a few high clouds by tomorrow evening, and I think for the most part, we should start to see things quiet down uh, tomorrow evening. Overnight lows tonight in the single digits and teens, highs tomorrow in the 30s. Again, we'll see some AM snow up here. That's where we've got the possibility to uh, see uh, one to three inches in some of our area uh, up in the four corners, some of the areas up there, and once you get the higher elevations, there'll be a little bit more. Overnight lows in the 20s and 30s back off towards the southwest, mainly de dealing with partly sunny skies, though. Of course, you head up towards Socorro, and you're seeing the snow. Tomorrow, it's going to be more or less sunshine for us. Same goes for the southeast overnight lows tonight in the teens and 20s. Highs tomorrow in the 40s and 50s. And off towards the north, we probably will see a little bit of snow here. A.M. snow possible. We don't have any advisories or warnings posted, but still something to kind of watch. You may see a flurry or two. That's not out of the question. And the northern mountains, definitely going to be dealing with snow from now through early tomorrow morning. Morning, and then by the afternoon, things kind of quiet down for us. Santa Fe, there you go. Looks like we're going to end up with a few flurries tomorrow morning, then clearing out by tomorrow evening and heading into Friday with highs continuing in the 40s. For these mountains, watch out for those roads. Temperatures overnight lows in the teens and 20s, highs tomorrow in the 30s, and back off towards the metro area across the board. We're looking for 20s uh, tonight. Tomorrow's highs only in the 40s. And keep in mind, we'll be under the gun for that snow activity through early tomorrow morning. And then by tomorrow evening and New Year's Day, looks like we'll stay pretty quiet and highs will be in the 40s. Okay. Thanks, Travis.